Welcome everyone and thanks for having a look at our day out at Kookaburra Park. I'm joined today by Phil, he's a good mate of mine and uh, him, him and I are both in the Somerset Wyvernet fish stocking group. This was a small bass day uh, with, a, with a surprise tarp on thrown in for good measure. Um, the small bass were signposts of a healthy brackish tidal fishery and something we all need to help protect. All the fish today were released. So go grab a coffee, sit back and enjoy the day that's about to unfold. We'll try down here a bit further. There's a nice little point down here with some trees on the end of it. Let's see, here we go. Yeah, it, 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 they're liking that snag there, right there. That's where it is. Yep! Oh. <laughs> what do you reckon? Same place, same place. Oh uh, well, let's see if I can get... He feels a little bit smaller. Smaller bass. Sweet as. He wasn't getting off. He was hooked with both of them, both trebles. Yeah. Nice little bass. We let him go. See if we can get him underwater again. So there he is. Just a little bass, but they're whacking pretty hard. Just one crank, bang, on again. Sweet. Yeah, <coughs> check this out. This is where I'm fishing today. Brisbane River. A tide is incoming. I'm heading towards College's Crossing and I'm just fishing all the snags on the way here. Which is not too shabby. Nice little smash over on that snag. This is a little bit bigger. I don't know what it is yet. Another bass. Come on, little fella. I'll take you. Here we go. Another little bass. Kookaburra Park does it again. There's lots of these around. This is the fourth one this morning. But who's complaining? A bass is a bass. Steady. It's well embedded. Gotcha. See you, little fella. And away he goes. Nice and slow, but he's gone. a snag over there, right at the base of that ball root over there. Bloody awesome.
Yep. Feisty, probably a little catfish. No, it's a little bass. Come on, come on. Oh well, another one bites the dust. Just a small bass, but uh, always get one. We're always seem to get one off this container. Deposited here through the floods. Some nice snags. And another big lay down over there, which is perfect. This one came off the container. Back in the water. Gone. Let's get back into it. So we picked up another one on the same container snag or close to it. This is the indicative of the bass that are in here. Just this one's a juvenile, obviously. So it's a healthy river system. Steady little fella, he's gone. Lives the fight another day. Okay, next cast, let's see what happens. Right past the container door. Uh, nothing that time, but anyway. Persevere, persevere. I'll try one tucked in over the back of the container. So far it's bass only. Um, I was hoping for a flathead actually, just up this far in the Brisbane River system, but uh, whoops, it may happen, who knows. Whack one back in there again. What I can say is the bass are really, really feisty here. I, I'm, I don't know why. They're only small, but they're whacking really, really hard. But then again, I've only got light gear. Just a little two to four kilogram spin stick. All good. I'm going to try around the other side. Okay, so we're coming up. We're coming up to an, uh, that same snag where that tree is, but I'm gonna I'm gonna chuck it in underneath somewhere. Well, it's close enough. Let's see what happens this time. Nothing yet. All my fish so far this morning have been basically hit the water, one, two cranks, bang, straight away. So, they're feisty, feisty. Oh yeah, check out that. How can you not throw a lure into that lot? How can you not? Nice, cast. Snagged up, snagged up. Absolutely to this. Gotta go in. I've wrecked that snag. Oh yes, at the boat again. Bloody hell there. Whatever this is, it's pulling hard. It's probably a big catfish. Oh uh, yeah, it is. But it was a bit of fun. Just cast right in over there. Anyway. Fish is up. Steady, steady. Ah, 
absolutely smash that lure. Absolutely. Yeah. Catfish is a catfish. Go on. Let's get into it. Looks like Phil has another one. A little bass. I got three out of that snag back there. Honey little, that size. It's all good though. That's a bass, isn't it? Oh, right. Yeah, no worries. Have a little talk to him. He's talking to you. Oh, yes. Right again. I don't know what this is. It might be a tarp on. It's got me wrapped around a on a branch. This is going to be messy, so I'll leave the camera rolling. Sort of. No, nah, he's bricked me. He's bricked me. Right on the stick. I think that was a tampon. A tampon. Sorry. Freudian slip. Um, that was a tarpon. Whew. to worry. It's an incoming tide. It's a it's a really good uh, it's a lunar table day. The um, the best bite time's coming up and I've already got seven, six six I think something like that. Yes. Anyway let's keep trying. It is a tarp on mate do they hit hard? Oh I missed the strike but uh, yeah, it's a, it's a nice tarp on. It, this one's going to go ape shit if I bring it into the boat. So I will retrieve. Oh, sorry, I attempt one of these. Oh, this is gold. You tried a lot. Well, okay. There we go. Brisbane River tarp on right up. They hit hard. Used to catch these on, on a six weight in the same location 25 years ago. See you later, fella. Come on. Get back into it. Ah, let's try the rock wall. Right, right under the power line. The serenity. Oop. Come on. There's got to be a fish around here. Check this out. Where we trying to turn around three things at once. Oh, it looks alright. Oh, shot the cast. Still, they're hitting out wide for some strange reason today. Virtually every fish I got today was in current when the water was moving past snags. I remember that.
Happens to the worst of us. As hard as this, this is a this is a classic example of a problematic lure, but I'm catching a lot of fish on it, so I'm not gonna give it away. It's an old SK, SK lure. And those bloody trebles get mixed up with the leader. It drives me freaking crazy. First world problems. Bite time is over. I'm heading back to the boat ramp and I'm just dragging a lure through the water on the way back. Got a couple of k's to go. Got to be somewhere this afternoon as usual. Got to head back to the boat ramp. Nothing much on the sand. But it's, uh, it's very nice and peaceful on this river. I'm going to come back here again next week. I'll probably bang the boat next week and uh, bring a few more lures, a few more options that I can throw in the water. <laughs> Just out of interest, there's some big power lines um, and the, uh, the towers are based on a bit of an island, it's a sandy island in the middle of the river and during the last floods um, a lot of it got washed away and I wonder if whether you know like the power authority has come out to check it for foundations. I'll give you another look when I get closer, I can't really tell which part away but uh, you know, right now I'm in, I'm in cruise mode. <laughs> Picked up something heavy on the troll on the way back. I'm not quite sure what this is. Might be a bit stick. <laughs> no, it's actually a fish. What have we got? Whoa, whoa. Okay. He's head butted at this point. Not too bad. It's pretty hard on the troll. Anyway, I don't normally do that, but today it paid dividends. Let's let him go. Okay, here we go.